Whew. I do not like going to the hospital. Oh, look at that. Liliana has been so sweet this whole entire time. Hey, you're pretty awesome, you know it. All right, guys, so there's really no time for an intro right now. Um, it's actually a little bit later at night, and Liam has been having trouble breathing all day long. Um, he hasn't been feeling well, and it's kind of escalated tonight. And I ran out of good camera. This is getting Liam ready. We're not going to, baby. We're just going to go there. We're going to check your, your chest. Things are just getting a little bit crazy because we've got to take him to the hospital. So his chest in this area is sinking in and um, they say that could be pretty serious so we want to make sure we hurry up and get him to the hospital and then do a breathing treatment um, and we're going to take the girls to Mimi and Papa's house. Yeah, we're going to try to be as quick as possible baby, okay? He's not very happy about going but this is the best thing for him. We're here to drop off the kids and oh look at that. Liliana has been so sweet this whole entire time. So we are on our way to the hospital. Sorry, it was a little crazy before. Um, we were just trying to get everybody going and get out the door and get him there as quickly as possible. So we are headed there right now. Cameron is getting us there safely. <laughs> but um, this is really weird for us to vlog or even think about vlogging because we've just been worried about taking care of him all day. But we decided to share our lives with you guys, so we decided to show a little bit. Of course, we're going to be taking care of Liam so much that we probably won't get much of it. But we will keep you guys updated and let you guys know how he's doing throughout the night and also in the morning. Okay, so we're at the hospital and we are um, getting ready to take Liam in. <sighs> I do not like going to the hospital. No. Somebody gave it to us for Disney World. Yeah, his chest is still doing it. All right, guys, so we actually have to use Alyssa's cell phone for this. Um, but, yeah, you can hear him coughing. They actually, when we got here, they brought us right back. We didn't even wait because uh, they knew it was pretty serious. serious. So and as soon as we got in the room, there was respiratory doctors. There were, uh, I mean, the doctors. I mean, there was like five, six people in here right away checking them out. So they're going to set him up on a breathing treatment. Oh, Bubby. Alyssa is trying to think she can to help him. Yeah. Hey, Bobby, how you feeling? You feeling okay? Oh. Jesus' name. Hey, you're pretty awesome, you know it? Yeah, you are. That's right, you are. It's actually really hard to see Liam like this because he's usually full of energy. If you guys have been watching our videos for a while, you'll know that he is just a ball of energy. And so to see him lay here like this, it's been pretty tough. It's not like him. So, so that you can watch TV and it, look, it says, welcome Liam. Is that your name up there? That's so cool. Oh my goodness, you're like a superstar, dude. They know you're here. It's so cool. So they're actually calling it a, what is it? Abstraction or asthma extraction or something like that. They can't diagnose him with asthma because he's too young. But Alyssa and I, both when we were younger, we had asthma. It's so like his chest is so tight. Yeah, they say he's working really hard because all of his muscles and his body are working to breathe, so. But they're gonna give him that breathing treatment and uh, it we'll should, yeah. should be cleared right up. I mean, just like that. So, Bubby, you're in good hands. Thankful it's nothing more than, you know, just a breathing treatment yeah. to fix it, so. Yeah, but they said we brought him in at the right time. So thank God that we, thank God that Alyssa was on top of it. She knew, I she did, have, you I knew. I couldn't have slept like that. No, she couldn't have. I, I mean, I wouldn't have been able to either because Liliana had the same situation, so we kind of knew mm -hmm. what was going on a little bit. So we're just waiting now and the doctors come back and get this treatment started. One, two, three, four. Good job, bud. I love you. Good job. Liam actually.
actually finished his treatment and man, he was top notch. He was amazing. Mm -hmm. Even the respiratory therapist was like, He's amazing. he is like the best model patient I've ever had. Mm -hmm. So, but he did really good. He's zonked out now. He's doing a lot better. So now we're just waiting on the doctors to come in. Check him again. And check him again to make sure that we're good to go. So. And we're ready to go, obviously. We're ready to go. It's all ready into the next day. We're just happy that he's doing better and can't wait to get him home in his bed. We'll keep you guys updated. Yep, dude, you were out. They said you'd be awake and wired, but you are out. All right, you guys, so we finally made it home. Um, they did send us home with a inhaler and I am just so happy to see him breathing good again. His chest was like sinking in and also I'm just I mean, he just, he's sleeping so much more peacefully. He was working so hard, you guys, to breathe. It was really hard to watch. So, that makes me so happy. Even if it's late and if we're tired, I'm happy that he is well taken care of and I can get some rest tonight knowing that he's sleeping good. Hey, Bubba, how are you doing this morning? Good. Good? Mm-hmm. Was the hospital scary? No. No? Well, guess what? You did so good last night literally everyone kept talking about how good you did they said that you were going to scream and you were going to be up because of all the medicine they gave you and you took everything you needed to take and you didn't scream at all and you fell right asleep you did everything opposite of what they said you were going to do you were amazing and now you're so much better high five buddy okay guys so it is morning and uh Liam got some rest and is actually feeling a lot better, aren't you, Bubby? <coughs> yeah? You feeling better? Yeah. yeah. Did you like going to the hospital last night? Yeah. You, oh, you did? <laughs> okay. Yeah, he said, because I said, was it scary? And he's like, no, it wasn't scary. No, he, Bubby, you did an awesome job. Did the, did the doctor tickle you last night? Huh? Do you not yes, remember he did. he was asleep? Well, the first time he wasn't asleep, but the second time he was asleep, wasn't he? Yeah, the doctor was checking him, and he, like, touched his stomach to check something. Liam and, and Liam went, <laughs> <laughs> like, really, he, like, jerked he, like, himself. Jerked. <laughs> it was hilarious. But we just want to say thank you guys for all your love and support during it. Um, if you're not on our Instagram or Twitter or Facebook, make sure you do, because you get to see behind-the-scenes stuff like this before it's released to YouTube. So we know this is a different kind of video. We just wanted to share, mm -hmm. you know, a little bit of our daily lives with you guys, which of course daily we don't go to the hospital, but, oh, yeah. <laughs> but we wanted to share with you, you know, kind of like what's going on and everything. But we are going to do a couple of shout outs today. Yes. And we have a shout out to Alexandra Frey, Ooh, Alexandra. Yes. And then an Ayana Wilson, 2003. Ayana Wilson. Thanks for following us, you guys, and being a part of our our family here and our journey yeah absolutely so Liam's doing better and he's look at what are you doing what are you doing Liam probably taking off all our ornaments yeah subscribe our channel and hit this bell <laughs> that was awesome subscribe to our channel and hit, hit the, the bell. bell and don't forget give this video a big, big thumbs, thumbs up. up we appreciate you guys thanks for watching bye, bye.